Carsonis City. So this is what's left of it. There's no time for nostalgia. The defenders of man are entrenched below these ruins. You should infiltrate their base while avoiding the Feral Zerg. I'm beginning to understand why Valerian didn't want to do this himself. All right. I'll start garrisoning soldiers around the area. They'll keep the ground secure while I head into the Defender's facility. You'll need some special upgrades for this. It happens that I've been adapting the jump jets for use with our factory vehicles. You've got to be kidding. That's incredible. It's science. Use it well, and we shall find what we're looking for. Yo, Mexican fucking jumping siege tanks. Holy shit. All right. Let's do some equipment. Um, so new things that we got here. Unfortunately, when I try when I trap myself the first time, it kind of removes the new. But I'll show you what we have. Um, this is new. Uh, increases Nova's vision and range of her non-Malay weapons by two. Increases uh, range of Nova's Malay weapons by one. Oh, but we don't have any Malay weapons. What the fuck is this game talking about? It's crazy. And then uh, we also have the uh, turbo jet jumpsuit, which is the Reaper thing. But we're going for cloak this time um what i do is i do uh ghost visor just because we can reveal okay i'm just gonna tell you this now if you get the 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 vision thing you can basically see uh sorry you can outrange detectors uh namely spore colonies you can just kind of shoot it to death with the the, the c20 canister rifle but i like to see burrowed units uh and instead i use the gr the pulse grenade kind of to to bring down detectors if i really need to and permanent cloak is a, is a must as well, I think, for this one. And I also, I also use a sniper just to uh, snipe the overseers as well. So we just uh, we use the kind of I guess the default loadout, which is like every every first item. That's my favorite for this. As for unit technology, we have a couple of choices here. So this is what this game does. Uh, this kind of DLC add-on does, which is basically you get a combination of one upgrade and you get to allocate it to one unit. So this one increases um, Marine's vision by two. Uh, or you could have Super Stimpak, which heals for uh, 30 life and increases movement and attack speed for 15 seconds. By the way, I mean, this is the only way your infantry has to heal. Um, you cannot make medics and you cannot make medivacs at any point during this campaign. Uh, you can't even make anything to heal your uh, tanks or anything. You depend upon the SCVs for that. So, technically, Super Stimpak is... A way you have of healing, but I just I think it just makes infantry really bad. So here's the Reapers with their spider mines, as you know from before, uh, which is a decent upgrade. I didn't have it to put on anything else at all. But we also have uh, the range upgrade, which increases vision by two and its weapon range by one. By the way, it can sometimes vary per unit. I mean, this makes it look like trash, like the way they show it in here. Not particularly any good. Uh, and then you have Super Stimpak. Uh, heals Reaper for 30 life. And increases the movement and attack speed once again. Not an incredible amount. Like, th th this one almost died right there. The Reaper is supposed to be good against Zerglings. It's even better. Fucking micro -ing. Um And so this is an interesting one. So th we have a new one here called... Um, allows Marauders to be trained at barracks without an attached tech lab. Uh, that's an that's a interesting one. Laser targeting. Vision by 2. Weapon range by 1. So, I mean, they keep showing this snowy map. This stuff. I mean, you get the gist of it. And we also have the Super Stim Pack as well. Which is a decent upgrade. Now for the meme one. Now we have fucking jump jet technology with siege tanks. That's the fucking best. Uh, also, they can jump all sieged. Oh no, Zerglings. Oh, oh, too slow. <laughs> that was the best one. Uh, you can also have spider mines with tanks. If you played the co-op, this is what Nova gets in the co-op, which is, uh, yeah, the spider mines with tanks. That's all it is. I mean, yeah, it's it's pretty good, but we use the jump jet just because it's a Mimi one. I mean, to be honest, we don't really leave the base too much, and there's obviously uh, internalized tech module. I think this is honestly probably one of the worst ones to put on anything, to be honest. It is useful for this mission, just for the Marauders, and I'll show you why later. Um, and stim pack on. I put I put my stim pack on my my hell bats. That's what I did here because I 
I like using. I mean, if you're gonna use anything as a tank, use the one with like that heals for sixty life rather than fucking thirty. But you know, that's just me, I guess. Because that's like, yeah. And then you can even get the jump shots where they'll well they'll they'll jump at them and stun them. It's it's kind of goofy. I won't lie. So the, my choices here are uh, the musts, uh, in my opinion, are definitely Marauder with this uh, internalized uh, tech module. Um, I mean, I put I put the jumping siege jinx just just for fun, and um, I use the stim pack on the hellbats. None of this is particularly important because we're not actually building a whole lot of units in this mission, and you'll see why. Uh, I'm not going for there's actually achievement to have less than 35 supply, but I'm not really going for that at all. So I'm just letting you know. Um, apparently, Nova gets a reward here potentially. Alright, welcome. Time to make SCVs. Zerg infestations have formed over the garrison entrances. You'll need to clear them away to gain access. Let's move. We won't be safe until our soldiers are in position. I like to make my, my bunker head kind of more over here. So we're going to actually sell this guy. Bring someone over there. Because we we have we have super bunkers here, which is like garrison forces. So Nova can already start kind of leaving and doing her own shit. And also we can make additional ghost academies. And why? It's because we have nuclear missiles now. Nova here. There's an infestation. That's even more disgusting than I expected. You best destroy it quickly. Go ahead. We're also gonna start mining our gas. Look lively. The feral Zerg have noticed you. Here I thought I was being quiet. Okay, the infestation's gone. We're ready to get some forces set up here. That turret's gonna go down. All right, so now we can make some reapers, so we can go here and make reapers. Uh, except I don't have enough gas for that. Let's uh, let's continue with the gas for a little bit. All right. And we don't have to do too much more with this one because the Reapers can kind of just jump over there. I'm just, I try and take out as much as I can because this is actually, this is a cliff. So because we can see the cloaked units, Got we can kind of just get that and we're done with, we're done with it. And so we're going to try and kind of clear here a little bit first, but there's a detector there as well. So we're going to wait for the nuke to come out. We make a couple of these. Right, now we need supply depots. We will do enough here, trust me. It will be more than enough uh, to deal with all these forces. I think I go usually for the infantry weapons, just because I think it affects the guys in here. Although they're not technically mine. It depends, but they have a huge range upgrade from this stuff, so we can kind of deal with this stuff. I'm gonna keep this. This is why I use the snipers, by the way. Oh, this is the this is the Grim Reaper. Insufficient Vespine gas. We're close. Insufficient. I like to make all. I like to make all of them go at one time. All right. I'm reading you. Let's uh, start clearing out some of this stuff. So I just kind of grenade these two assholes. Acknowledged. There we go. And we can actually just kind of finish this off. I'm afraid more Zerg are on the way. Prepare for a fight. 
Well, we didn't come here for fun, did we? Nova, I have completed preparations for a nuclear strike. You may call me down when needed. Excellent work, Rigel. Never know when I'm gonna find myself outnumbered. Oh, I guess that does it for that. Oh wait, there's a little bit more. Alright, we need to have two SCVs kind of up here and repairing this. Actually, wait, why did I even bother? See, I don't even know why I bother unseaging them at all, ever. Where's our other fucking supply depot? Right there, that's where it is. Okay, I'm gonna make uh, some turrets. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna jump shed him back here. Gee, fuck, get out of the way. Why does the, why does the thing the things move for me? It's ridiculous. I thought we had the technology, but apparently not. Technology wasn't here yet. Anyways, I'm gonna keep clearing this this out over here. And we make marauders now. Alright, where's supply depots? We do that. Make an whoops, come on, man. Uh, make make this. And there we go. So I make about four nuke silos. Whoops. Wow, that fucking froze. Alright, where's Reapers? Alright, so Reapers, you can just run them straight over here and they shouldn't die. There you go. We just filled that up. Now, they're not going to do much besides just sit there. Which is unfortunate, but it's whatever. And I think the next one, I don't even know what the next one is. No, there's some with Marines, so we'll just get some Marines. And we already have our next nuke. Just want to kill this thing. Get in there, you asshole. Nova, I've been tracking a defenders of man cargo ship near our position. It has fallen under attack by the Zerg. Any survivors? Some Dominion prisoners of war. They'll need help evacuating. I'm on it. Status report. So we're gonna just kind of continue with this. We're gonna wait until we see a detector there. And we nuke the shit out of that. They also spawn from these supply depots, so I'll just take them out. The optional objective we'll get soon, uh, but not now. No, my SCV. Alright, let's make that into an upgrade. And Nuke is ready. Zerg activity is increasing across multiple hives. You appear to have caused quite a bit of trouble. I'm good at that. I just hope you're good at getting out of it. Alright, we're good with that. Got it. Upgrade, not enough energy. Alright, where's my marines? Alright. We're gonna start sending them over here. Alright, we're gonna send Nova with them. Just to make sure they make it there. As long as they get into the garrison, we're fine. We got another nuke already. Like, they have no stims, so they can't run to it, but we're fine. There we go. Now we have another one right there. I think this one's also marine, so we're just going to make a couple of those. And uh, I, with this factory, I was going to make some uh, hell bats. Could probably also use a... Uh, What are those things? <laughs> the armory, armory. I, I say things a lot when I play this game, but whatever. So here we can actually just pulse grenade this thing to death. It's kind of you step into its radius and just step out of it. Not now we just kind of take these guys out by uh, these Zerg out in the, in the old good old-fashioned way of just uh, kind of hanging out with them here. Uh, do we have enough? Why? This guy's stuck here. Oh, don't, don't worry, we can fix that. All without unseaging. Alright, let me see. Is this good enough? Okay, this is probably good. 
Where are, the, where are my Marines? How many do we have? Is that enough? That is enough. Just barely enough, though. We could probably make it down there. Uh, I don't know if we're actually going to go there, though. I'll just speed this thing along. Alright. Get in there. So I probably could do this with like the, the less um This garrison set. Now we just have one left. Now we need Reapers for this guy. And I think we're, are we actually done with this after that? Yeah, we are. So we actually have to go and, um, we have to take, we, we gotta get the optional objective, otherwise it won't let me do it. No, we have enough nukes to handle the job. In fact, I didn't even need any of this. Got two nukes. See, I'm incredibly lazy and I don't want to use my, my precious nukes. Alright, we're good. They can't detect us now. Where's the Grim Reapers? Oh shit, no, no, no. no go back. Get on the fucking that thing. Wow, I have a lot of SCVs not doing anything. Alright. We can use our nukes. So, so they actually give you some medics right here. But you can see I didn't even bother to go for them because they just simply weren't needed. As long as you clear a path with Nova, it's fine. Holy shit, it's like you. Take caution. My scans show that enemies are flying toward us from the southeast. I've located the survivors. They're in good shape, so they'll be joining us in the fight ahead. The defenders had schematics here, too. I'll send them your way. How interesting. Strictly business. Got it. So there's some flyers over here. And don't worry, we built some shit for that. Tucker, go fuck yourself. Okay, guess what? We got an energy sword. We're Halo now. Executing. My scans indicate that there's a communications hub ahead. I'll check it out. Form up for patrols. Vigilance is our highest priority. <laughs> Vigilance, huh? By the way, you get sweet, sweet achievements for not uh, killing anybody. Right. It's actually incredibly easy to do. Uh, I forgot I'd do this one. I right, just... Oh god, what was that? Loud and clear. So we're playing a uh, non-lethal run. Acknowledged. Consider it done. Alright, so this one has like a little spinny turret that's trying to detect me. So the best way right. in that I figured was it getting this guy. Strictly business. And then I usually just dash for the end. I mean, it's fun to kill everything, but what's even more fun is achievements. You were right, Rigel. It is the comms room. Let's listen in. We have a security breach. All personnel should evacuate immediately so we can scrub the facility. I, I think this might be an extreme measure. No, no, I understand. This is bigger than we are. 
I will finalize the preparations. They're shutting down. I don't have much time to get answers. Find out where he's going. Say again? Got it. There may be another communication terminal further along. My scans are inconclusive. It's a good enough lead for now. Who is that? En route. Ooh. Ooh. Evacuation ships ready to go. Everyone out. We just stunned the shit Got out of all of them. Hell, she's gone already. Acknowledged. Executing. The emitter's activated. Go, go, go! A psi emitter? How did they get a hold of one of those? You don't have long to find out. It's drawing Zerg into the facility. On the move. Hold that sector until they're done. I'll give the order when it's time. Uh, this one's kind of interesting. Oh, fuck me. What? How do you not see me? Am I cheating and I don't know it? They're rushing out of here. That might be their first sensible course of action. By the way, the achievement is for not killing anybody, so if you want, you can stun the flame bat guys and then their Zerglings will eventually get through and kill them. Apparently I'm a fucking cheater because he didn't detect me and I don't understand why. No, I think it's just a bug or something. Large numbers of Zerg are mobilizing. Their emitter seems to be highly effective. So I'm showing you how to do it right now with uh, letting the Zerg kill them basically. So you just wait for a wave and you stun them all. And Zerg will deal with them. So I don't get punished for this, even though technically I'm killing them. And now the, the ghost that was originally defending that area is no longer kind of looking at it. He's distracted now. Apparently, I'm really good at stealth. Who would have thought? Got it. There's an overseer here. I'd better avoid it. I think you can stun grenade them. I'm curious. Everywhere, Rigel. Okay, no, you can't stun grenade them. You have to just avoid them. Although now I delayed him, so we got to make sure we stay out of his little radius. Would probably mean certain death. There's one right there. We can start kind of heading through here. I've located the communication terminal. It's just beyond your present location. So that's why they're all here. Alright, we're going to wait for the turret to spin around, stun that guy, and just go through. is failing. I will recall forces on your order, Nova. Do it. I can get out of here myself after I catch this guy. He's just ahead. So I, I didn't kill any of their units, so it doesn't care, and uh, that's it. That's all we have to do. plan hasn't changed. All teams ready for deployment. Stand by. Operation Live. Some will die so others can live. No! Huh? <sighs> Target world identified. Calculating anticipated casualties. Rigel, I've got intel. Yes. 
The defenders of man are staging a Zerg attack on a civilian world. But why? They're trying to discredit Emperor Valerian. Enough Zerg attacks and he'll look weak. Thousands will die, Rigel. We have to stop this now! It looks like Novus is as good as stealth as I am.